peace. How is everyone doing today? Happy Friday. Thank God it's Friday night and I just got paid. Um, I am, I was thinking about like five years ago, um, what I was doing five years ago and I'm, 2015 is kind of a blur, but I know I traveled a good amount domestically. I think that was my domestic year because I tried to alternate um, between domestic travel and international tra travel each year. So it was my domestic year. So I know I was in New Orleans, I was in San Francisco, I was in Myrtle Beach. Um, I could have been somewhere else, but life was completely different. <laughs> All I really cared about is just having enough money to pay my rent and travel. Um, I, let's see, I was a caseworker, an income maintenance caseworker um, for welfare or Department of Children and Families or whatever. They changed their name too. But um, yeah, I, what was it? It was my was in my first year of being a caseworker because I had still worked for that department, but I was a clerk previously. So I was a caseworker. Um, yeah, I was making more money than I'd ever had, which isn't that much <laughs> still. But that's what I was doing. Life was completely different. It was this time five years ago. It was probably a few months out from me starting Mellow Vibes, the first iteration of Mellow Vibes, which was a blog, and I, you know, shared my travel stories and recommendations for different things, and um, sold my my jewelry that I made um, with natural materials. But yeah, I was a few months out from that. Really, let's see, like the shift from then to now. I don't know like I'm not really sure what I was thinking other than I know I wanted to I think 2015 was also the last the year of the last song that I had written prior to um, me writing a couple years ago for my first EP um, so it was like a year a span of like two and a half three years before between like the last songs that I'd written uh, so yeah, 2015, that was definitely the last, I was trying, I know I was trying to get back into like doing music. I was performing. I was performing regularly, but I hadn't been like trying to record anything. I remember my, he wasn't my supervisor, but one of the supervisors who I talked to all the time, he's an income maintenance supervisor, he made beats <laughs> and he like gave me a beat to write to. And that was like the last song I had written in a long time. And um, it's funny cause he doesn't work there anymore either. Like he, he quit to go to LA and, and make music. So, um, yeah, that was, that was what was going on. I mean, it was just a world of a difference. Um, I guess I had more money <laughs> than I do now, but I'm definitely like freer than I was. I, I could probably only dream of being at the place where I was then. I know I had wanted to do coaching. It was something that was on my mind for literally 10 years, but I was just like, no, 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 no. Um, yeah, I mean, so my life was just so different. Um, yeah, I don't know. <laughs> like, where were you five years ago? Are you closer to your... Hello. Um, yeah, where were you five years ago? Are you closer to your, you know, your goals now than you were then? Uh, what shifts what shifts did you make? Um, I mean, I took a huge leap because I think, yeah, five years ago today, I mean, it was less than a year out from when I quit. And I was just like, I, I can't do this anymore. I need to go after my dreams. Um, so it was it was a little bit before making a, a, a big leap, probably one of my first big leaps. So life was very different five years ago. And I'm so happy that it is. <laughs> uh, so yeah, let me know. I'd like to hear your stories of how, how your life was five years ago. Because mine is just, it's so it's drastically different. I am definitely more in tune with myself than I was five years ago, which is amazing. 
So I'd like to hear your stories. But that's it for today. I'm gonna peace out. I might interview in less than three years. In less, 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 than three, less than three hours. I might interview in less than three hours. Um, like I said in I don't know two videos ago, I'm doing an interview with my alma mater, which is gonna be interesting. So we'll see. Very. Your life is very different, Rodney. Yes, I'd like to know how. <laughs> I was definitely holding myself back a ton five years ago, and now I'm not doing that anymore. So, super, super different. But I'm going to go. I'm going to get into some work before this interview. And I'll see you later. Peace and mellow vibes.